Today, we're going to be creating kindness neighborhoods inspired by Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. We're going to be thinking about what it means to be a good neighbor and some kind things that we can say to our neighbors or people around us. We're going to work together and collaborate to make these kindness neighborhoods to hang up in our hallway. Let's get started. You'll start with a large piece of square colored paper to create your door for your house. When you open the door, it's going to say something kind to the people in our school neighborhood. So we start by folding our door in half so that it can open. And it'll open like a book or a door. Then I'm going to start to decorate my door using a Sharpie or a black marker. I'm going to open up the door and first decide what I want it to say. I'm going to do my best to spell things correctly so if I'm not sure I'll ask Miss W and to write neatly so that when people see these in the hallway they can read them. So I chose to write you make me smile you can even use crayons and other things to um, decorate the inside of the door. Then on the front of the door, go ahead and trace around the frame with your black marker, add a door handle, maybe windows or panels to decorate your door. Once your door is finished, uh, you're welcome to add color with your crayons or construction paper crayons if you would like um, to add another color to make our neighborhood nice and bright. When you are done with that, you will use a glue stick to trace the edges of the back of the door. Press it down onto your paper and give it a massage for 10 seconds to make sure it sticks. Voila! Now your door can open and we can read your kind message. After you have completed your door, it's time to add windows and other decorations to your house. You can decide if you want the colors to match or if you want to have a rainbow colored neighborhood. It's totally up to you. Pick some squares and rectangles, draw designs with your black marker on them to show the window panes and different things like that. Whenever you are done decorating a window or a pair of windows, use your glue stick to fill the back with glue and give them a massage. Don't forget to use crayons to add even more colors and patterns to anything that you add to your house. Here again, I'm using my glue, Ooh, wrong way. pressing it down, giving it a massage, making sure it will stick and then putting my lid back on my glue. Um, you are welcome to draw things right on the paper as well, as you can see I'm doing here. Um, you can show where the roof is on the house by adding patterns and designs with lines and your marker, or if you want to use crayons to add color, you're more than welcome to do that. If you want to add a house number or other decorations, go ahead and do that um, using your marker and crayons. I even added a little plant next to my door. Let your imagination run wild. If you finish adding decorations to one house and using good craftsmanship to do it, you are welcome to add more things to a second house. Just make sure you have a door that opens um, that says something kind and you use your glue stick to glue things on, give them a massage, and use crayons to add even more color and designs. I can't wait to see your kindness neighborhoods that you work on together. Good luck!